Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Hi, if you're new here, my name is Chelsea and thank you so much for clicking on my video. Hey girl. So today we're gonna be installing a wig. As you can see, I've got my, you know, something going on on my head. The wig that we're installing today is from XRS. And I just wanted to show you guys how, what actually comes in the box. I'm not sure if you're gonna receive the same thing, but this is what came in my box. So the wig comes in this plastic bag and it's a 20 inch wig with 200% density. Um, and this is how the wig looks like. So it has this, um, you know, the, the net thingy. It's a 13 by six frontal. I love 13 by six. It's just, it's just amazing when you're doing the parts, you know, and it just goes in a lot deeper. Um, the knots are completely bleached. I didn't have to bleach the knots and the lace is HD and they're actually calling it the new clear lace. I wanted to show you guys the difference between the normal transparent lace and this completely undetectable clear lace. As you guys can see, um, I hope it's actually clear on camera, but the clear lace, you literally can't even see the grids. You can't see where the lace actually begins and where it ends. Um, but the transparent lace you can still see a bit of the grid and whatever So the clear lace is definitely what you want because that is literally it's giving scalp It's giving the hair is growing out of my head. What are you gonna do about it? And then this is how it looks on the inside it has two combs on the side and one in the middle and one at the end as well and then it also comes with the adjustable strap so if you want to make the wig tighter you can do that and then a few more goodies in the box um a wide tooth comb i think there's an elastic band for the wig some wig caps oh and an edge brush a yellow one actually i've never seen a colored edge brush which is exciting and some flexi rods as well so we're just gonna jump into installing the wig i love the quality of this hair so much i just i can't wait to see how it's actually gonna look on my head okay i know i look crazy but trust the process this is actually the first time i'm doing the ball cap method and i just went in with the got to be to glue my wig cap i never really keep my wigs for that long most of the time I end up taking the wig off immediately after I film or if I went somewhere, I did go somewhere after this day. So I took the wig off later on in the evening. And then now we're just going straight into the install this is the wig straight out of the box i have not done anything to this wig and i do have to say that it's very important for me to say that because i really appreciate the companies that go out of their way to customize their wigs it's just so much easier because you get everything in the box and you can literally start the installation process immediately i'm just cutting down the air tabs with this nail scissors The wig was quite big on me. I, I, I picked the wig in a medium size. Maybe I should have gone smaller. The front is coming way lower than I would prefer. I do have a big forehead and <laughs> I'm actually very comfortable with my forehead. So I don't like to cover my forehead because it, it, it looks a bit weird on me when my, my forehead is like too covered because I'm used to my forehead being big. So I'm okay with it just being big. You guys know that i'm still a beginner at wearing wigs so i've been trying different techniques to see what i prefer and this time i decided to melt the lace first before cutting the excess and that's just what i did here so as you guys can see i am pulling off the excess lace so that i can get closer to my actual hairline and i'm going in with an eyebrow razor to create a jagged look for the wig 
because of how clear this lace is i always i was really struggling to see the lace and i am short-sighted so i was wearing contact lenses i just need to focus when it comes to this bit so if you see me making any mistakes or whatever i was honestly just trying to see exactly what i'm doing because this lace completely undetectable when they say a clear lace they totally mean it So at this point, I'm just going in with a little more got to be to make sure to completely flatten the edges of the lace. Because as you guys can see, there's like a whitish demarcation on the hairline. And once I go in with the got to be, it's completely disappearing into the skin. Truly, truly giving this is my hairline. This is my scalp. This is my hair. Do you see any lace? Do you see any lace? Yeah, thank you. And now just creating some baby hair for you guys and i know you guys can see the 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 white um demarcation on the hairline that is not the lace actually that's just the excess got to be and later on in the video you guys will see that it completely disappeared so what i did is i just went in with a wet wipe and just wiped off the excess and then i put on a bit of concealer at the front because my makeup was definitely going crazy I'm adding the concealer onto the middle part okay well the missing the middle part because it's not even the middle and now this is the first time I was doing this so if this is not how I'm supposed to do it then we're gonna learn the process but um I decided to create some <laughs> layers I'm just trying to be fancy okay I had this vision in my head which I don't know if I actually accomplished you guys will tell me at the end of the video but um yeah that's what i'm trying to do i wanted the hair to be in layers because i like the the much fuller look on my head and let me tell you guys i don't know what it is but this curling process got on my nerves this was the first time i was i was using a curling iron and oh god I, i'm just i'm just glad that i sort of figured it out but i kept confusing what side i was going and what i was supposed to do it, it was a mess it was a whole mess but anyway we tried we we were happy we still managed to do something so please don't be too harsh on the comments i was this was honestly the first time i was using this curling iron so i hope i even was using it right but um yeah so basically just curling my hair curling my hair curling my hair um, and also just to take you guys back to what i had said earlier um you guys remember the white line of like the the white line of death on my hairline and you can see right now it's literally giving skin because that was just excess got to be spray as i've told you guys and once i wiped off the excess it was it was back to normal and now it's just you can't how no one can tell me that this is not my hair i'm sorry no one can tell me apart from you guys who are watching the video no one else can tell me that this is not my hair this is just me on a random day curling my hair you know it's coming from my scalp
And once I was done curling my hair, I just went in with the Kara Care wax stick to tame down the flyaways and then top that with my hot comb, which was fully heated to just make sure that that hair is lying flat. I'm so sorry, you guys, that this middle part is giving missing the point it's giving corner of the head it's not it's not even it's not a middle part and it's not a side part it's like i don't know what it's doing but the entire video i did i thought this thing was straight because it took me a minute to even get it like that but actually it's not even straight but um you guys get the point look at that lace look at how beautiful this hair is i was feeling myself i was literally feeling myself so much i really really love the quality of the hair i love how they customize the hair um even after cutting further into the lace i didn't have to do any more plucking because the hair was just perfect so please make sure you check the links in the description box if you want to get this hair for yourself or if you want to get a different type of hair from xrs beauty because they are truly the one honestly all these brands that customize their wigs they have a special place in heaven but thank you guys so so much for watching i love you guys so much make sure you like the video subscribe if you haven't i love you guys bye